Hi folks, it's Arnold here. I hope this finds you well. It's my privilege to try to retell in poem form some of the stories from the best storyteller who has ever lived. His stories were not just entertaining. Every one had an important message for the listeners. Today's poem is based on a conversation Jesus had with a high-up religious leader called Nicodemus, who came to Jesus one night to ask him about the meaning of life. Jesus' reply changed his life. It can do the same for you. You can find this story in John chapter 3. I have given it the title, Look and Live. Jesus told a story one day to explain how Nicodemus could escape a great loss. He spoke of a serpent of bronze on a pole that foretold his own death on a cross. The people of God had left Egypt behind and set off for their promised land. Though God had provided both water and bread, still their grumblings just got out of hand. Why have you brought us to this wilderness place where there is no food and no water to drink? They threatened rebellion and turned against God, left Moses wondering just what to think. God loves his people, but they needed to learn that sin can't go unchecked or ignored. He sent venomous snakes, many grumblers died, but God's plan was the rest be restored. They came to Moses in contrition and said, we have sinned against both God and you. Please ask God to forgive us. Take these snakes away. When he prayed, not a snake was in view. Many bitten were dying, but God had a plan. His love led him to act and forgive. Make a bronze snake, put it up on a pole. Those who look at it will certainly live. And just as that snake was lifted up high, the Lord Jesus was raised on a cross. Now, whoever looks to him and believes, will be saved and will not suffer loss. In this unstable world of sickness and loss, when it feels we've got nothing to give, God has provided a way back to safety in him. Look to Jesus, trust him, and you'll live. Thanks very much for taking the time to listen to my poem. I hope it was enjoyable and helpful to you. Please feel free to share it with anyone you think might appreciate it. If you would like to hear some more, then just press the subscribe button. In the meantime, keep well and be blessed.